Frame Queens. How, I, I'm a flash forwarding into the hospital. Yes, we're in the hospital, and uh, I have a very interesting storyline this what year. What is which your storyline? Are you a doctor now? Or I'm you not a, a doctor. You're a patient? Possibly. I mean, it's, so. it's a hospital. <laughs> you're like a doctor, a patient, doctor, or a janitor. <laughs> there you go. I'm not a doctor. So, I mean, all my Grey's Anatomy dreams are not going to come true this year oh, on Scream Queens. Gosh. But I love playing crazy. There's nothing better than that. So I get to continue that with uh, with season two. How, how crazy do you think they're going to take this season coming? I think this season's going to be wild. I, I, I think this season's going to be way darker than last season, um, which I'm excited about. And then, I mean, I don't know. I just, I can't wait to see how the dynamics between the characters change because like last season, we were all either like best friends or literally trying to murder each other. So I uh, I don't know what's going to happen. Are you having fun? You know I am. I'm having a blast. I'm, ex I'm trying to figure out if I can get some more information on Scream Queens while I'm here because you know they don't tell us nothing on our I heard show. it skipped. Yeah, it skipped a little bit of time. So now I'm a doctor. Dean Munch now owns a hospital. She completely switched careers. And this is all I know thus far. What else can they possibly do? How are they going to push this envelope? <laughs> well, here's what I know. I know the show takes place in the future from when the last one did. So there's a skip. And I know that I'm a doctor. And I know that it takes place at a hospital. She's, she's learning to be a doctor, you know, as Chanel number three would. Where, what, how else would she progress? She's studying to be a doctor, of course. <laughs> I'm just scared because so many sharp things in the hospital, so there many are. places to get killed. Right? It's a good thing. Or not, depending on who you are. And then there's so many, like, sharp things in the hospital to kill people with and I mean, I think I did enough blood killing with. in season one. So uh, I feel like she's, uh, I think she's she's done with the killing. But you we'll think see. so? I mean, I hope so. Or just the crazy side, denying the killing? I don't know. I, it was a lot of hard work that she put into season one. I think it's hilarious that this season she's like, I swear, you guys, it's really not me. So we'll see what happens. Anybody on your hit list, who would you like to kill on the show? <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer, but I think you're like, maybe, I don't know. No, no, no. I, uh, no, no one. No, no one. You can I, kill them, they can come back to life. No. There's going to be blood everywhere. It's probably going to be really disgusting. You know, that's how Ryan likes it. So it'll be really disgusting and really funny.